Hi, I'm George Edelman with Studio Binder, and today we're going to talk about locations on the call sheet. There's a lot of things you can do with your locations on a call sheet to highlight them or be specific to make it easier for people to arrive at the proper place. We're going to go through some of the basics of getting it all on there, including parking and nearby hospital and a couple tips along the way. Let's get started. And you'll see our weather details will be updated once we enter a shooting location. Let's say we're going to shoot at this coffee place. Phil's Coffee nearby. I will put a parking address. I happen to know that the Santa Monica Public Library is right there. Great parking. And special instructions here. Costs $10 a day. And you can bring receipt to production. And we will reimburse. It really makes sense to find good parking right near your location. You really don't want people to be hunting for parking because then they'll be late. You also don't want them to be stressed. You also don't want anyone getting tickets because then if you have to reimburse that, it's a lot more than just paying for parking. Now the next thing we'll address here is the hospital. I we'll want to do a medical center that I know has a 24 hour facility. So as you can see, we can add this location to our library. We can remove it from the call sheet altogether. We can import a location that we have saved. Got this Santa Monica Pier location here. So there's no address and we just have some notes. I'm gonna put them in bold so people take special note. And we can always add a location that we just put in here. So let's say it's a locker, <clears throat> which we know is nearby there as well. And let's say the mall parking. Monica Place, same hospital once again. So there we have three locations. We can reorder them if need be, but of course that will have a cascading effect on the rest of our day. We don't want to have any confusion, so make sure if you make a change like that, say the pier is shooting first, then you look down here at your schedule, see where your pier scene is, you move it up here and then everything else including your times all has to change so those are the basics with locations on your call sheet hopefully we've covered a few things that'll make it more helpful for you when you're making your own call sheets if there's anything specific you'd like to see us cover more of please let us know in the comments and if there's anything you think we missed let us know that as well and if you want to watch more videos like this subscribe to our channel and until then good luck and thanks for watching